Celtics fans, they have been through a lot this season, but they're not giving up hope. They're confident that this team can still win it all. WBZ's Christina Hager spoke to one young man who says he'll display his Celtics pride tomorrow, no matter what happens tonight. Eight-year-old Jack Tornatori loves his haircut. I love it. Because, well, it's obviously good luck. This is Jack. He got out of school early, sporting his unfinished business T-shirt because of a hair emergency. The logo on his head was growing out. What's your prediction, Jack, for tonight? What do you think? Jack's confidence is pretty closely tied to his buzz cut. See, his barber, Mike Moriello, is known around Saugus as an artist with clippers. We've been pretty successful in Boston with our sports over the years here, the last couple of decades, so I like to think it's uh, all because of my haircuts. And good luck charms are in order tonight. General Mass General Hospital Dr. Alexandra Gold explains happen. the psychological tension for fans. Let's say you're in the moment watching a game. You're unsure what's going to happen, if the team's going to win or lose. Maybe you're getting stressed. Maybe you're getting anxious. And the emotions go into overdrive. And it's hard to kind of take that step back. That's why Jack keeps a healthy attitude. Win or lose, you going to wear this proudly? I'm going to wear it proudly, yeah. No hat? No. I don't think any Boston fan is ever embarrassed to walk around with that Boston logo. I think it actually works. I'm a big Celtics fan, no matter if they win or lose. It's something that uh, everyone's proud to have on uh, win or lose, but hopefully win. Dr. Gold says Jack actually has the healthiest kind of attitude because his emotional ties are not tied to winning or losing. He says tomorrow he'll be happy to sport the C's logo on his head, no matter how this plays out. At the Garden, Christina Hager, WBZ News. All right, Christina, thank you.